I am Adil Kumar. Welcome to my series on Work Done Problem Solving Strategy. The question here is, six men and eight women can do a piece of work in 10 days. 26 men and 48 women can do that work in two days. Find the time taken by 15 men and 10 women to complete it. Now let M be the rate at which men do the work, right? So we'll say M is units per day. Number of units per day for men. And W is number of units per day for women. This is for men. So each person's units per day will say capital M. And for each woman, units per day will say their rate of work, right? So we define their rate of work. Now the idea here is to find total work. So in this case, total work will be rate. This is the rate, right? So rate, I should call this as the rate, say, into days. So when you multiply units per day with days, when you say, think about it, units per day times day, then what you get is units. And this units will be called total work, right? Work done or total work. Is that clear to you? So that is the basic concept to work with. Now, in this case, six men and eight women, so that's a combination of M and W, right? Six men means six M, right? Plus eight women can do a piece of work in 10 days. So we are going to multiply this by 10 equals to 26 men and 48 women. 26 men plus 48 women in two days. So we get our equation. So this equation tells us how the same work is being done by two different groups. Now we could simplify this and then find the ratio of M and W, right? So basically we could just divide, simplify this. So what we get here is six times five let me write down, we will write in two statements, right? So 8W times 5 is equals to 26M plus 48 women. Now bringing them together, let's say we take this to uh, multiply them. So we get 30M plus 8 times 5 is 40W equals to 26M plus 48W, right? So we can write this as 30m minus 26m equals to 48w minus 40w. So that gives you four men can do the same work as eight women. So the ratio of work done by men and women comes out to be 8 by 4 or you can say lowest form 2 to 1. So that means for men it is two units per day, right? So this is two, think like this, units per day, right? And for women, it will be so many units per day. So that is how, sorry, this is W, right? You brought this down. So we will assume that, that a woman can do one unit per day and a man can do two units per day. So we got the rate of both men and women for a particular job which we are talking about. So now we can define total amount of jobs. So total work. Total work for us will be, you could take any combination, six men and for each man it is two units, right? So six times two units per day plus eight women eight times one unit per day right and they work for how many days 10 days so we multiply this by 10 is that clear to you so that gives you 
12 and 8 which is 20 right times 10 which is equal to 200 so we have 200 units of work what do we need to find we need to find time taken by 15 men and 10 women so time will be equal to total work over rate so in our case total work is 200 and we are going to divide this by the group 15 men so 15 men will mean 15 will work at the rate of 2 units per day this is total number of units plus 10 women 10 women will work at the rate of 1 unit per day correct so we get 200 divided by 30 plus 10 which is 40 correct so from here we get our answer which is 20 divided by 4 as 5 days so in this case we saw that 15 men and 10 women can complete the whole job in 5 days perfect so that is how these questions can be solved I hope it makes sense. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.